What if your car knew how to keep itself in check, before you did? In the late 80s, Formula One engineers answered that question with a game-changing technology traction control. Using clever sensors and electronic brain power, traction control monitored the rear wheels and softened throttle response when grip broke loose. Teams like Lotus, Benetton, and Williams weren't just building faster cars, they were building smarter ones. By the early 90s, the systems were so refined that drivers could blast out of corners with perfect precision. No more dancing on the limit, it was about delivering power with surgical control. For purists, though, it didn't sit right. They worried Formula One was becoming a battle of coders, not courage. In 1994, the FIA hit the brakes, banning traction control to bring the driver's touch back into the spotlight. But as tech evolved, the system returned only to be banned again in 2008, this time for good. Today's Formula One drivers pilot hybrid beasts with over a thousand horsepower, all without driver aids like traction control. It's just man, machine, and muscle memory. But the legacy of those early systems lives on, in road cars, racing sims, and how we think about control at the absolute edge. Because in a sport where tenths of a second change everything, sometimes the smartest advantage isn't just horsepower, it's how you manage it. And, trust me, traction control was just the beginning. Stay tuned, more legendary race tech is coming down the straight.